We are here in Adamstown on Pitcairn Island about to witness the very first drone video taken on the island of a humpback whale nurturing her newborn baby. Pitcairn Island truly is a tiny speck in the middle of the Pacific. And when I say the middle, I mean the middle. Watch what happens when we zoom out to space. There is almost no visible land anywhere to be seen. This is my favorite picture that I've taken of Pitcairn. It shows its rugged beauty. Pitcairn Island is known for the famous Mutiny on the Bounty saga that concluded here in 1790. I had the honor of my photographs being made into stamps. Here are a few that were. I took this thrilling picture of Bounty Bay looking over the edge of Ship Landing Point. Stamps were also made of some of my bounty artifacts. For those who have seen my other videos will recognize this picture taken from my drone. Before we fly out to see the whales, let's take a look at a sunrise over Bounty Bay. We are standing in the exact spot where Fletcher Christian and the mutineers came ashore. Here one feels so removed from the chaos and troubles of the world. The bounty lies just beyond the large wave that is breaking offshore. The reddest soil I have ever seen is on Pitcairn Island, probably due to the high iron content in the soil. I'm collecting a sample of it to take home. We are on our way down to the southern shore where I'm going to be flying my drone far offshore to see if I can get a full frame photograph of the island. Pitcairn Island has the cleanest water in the world. It is as far removed from any pollution caused by man. We are offshore at the extreme limit of the drone's capability getting this incredible video. Out of the corner of my eye I saw the splash. Thinking it might be a whale, I put the drone into a steep dive, and to my amazement the splash was a mother humpback whale teaching its newborn baby how to swim. We are in a little over 200 feet of water, and you can still make out the bottom. The lighter areas are sand and the darker is coral.
Like a sentry guard, the mother is watching from below while her baby can practice swimming and breathing in safety. I believe the mother is coaxing her baby to dive down to her. It seems to me the baby is calling her mother to surface. Watch closely. You can see the mother is slowly rising to the surface. I kept my distance from the whales so I would not disturb them. These shots are zoomed in to give you a better view. Here we can see the affection the baby has for its mother as it cuddles up to her. The mother gives her baby a little nudge. Look closely and you'll see a wahoo swimming over the tail of the mother. To give you an idea of what a wahoo looks like, this is a tuna on the left and a wahoo on the right that was caught off the island in 1953. I was invited to go out on a fishing trip to catch dinner for the island. On the way out we encountered this whale. Shortly after, we set the lines in a few minutes, caught five wahoo, which was enough for everyone's dinner that evening. Back to our whales. Here you can see the wahoo swimming over the mother's tail again as we ascend to head back to shore to charge our batteries.
some of the most stunning sunsets can be seen here on Pitcairn Island. Thank you for watching, and I'm sure you will agree that Pitcairn Island is one of the most unique places on Earth. Pitcairn is difficult to get to. The journey to the island is an adventure in itself. If you are looking for an adventure to escape from the world, look no farther. <laughs>